15 days novena for victory daily prayers prayer one father god i come before you in the name of your son jesus christ praising you with all my heart mind and strength for the victory you have given me through jesus christ my personal lord and savior the bible says that jesus christ has redeemed me from the curse of the law therefore sickness disease pain suffering poverty and death has no power over me i am now free from the law of sin and death the spirit of christ jesus dwells in me my body is a temple for the holy spirit redeemed cleansed and sanctified by the blood of jesus i am a child of the living god i claim my victory in the name of jesus over all the works of the devil satan you are a defeated foe i resist you in the name of jesus christ i overcome you by the blood of the lamb and by the word of my testimony i am anointed by the power of the holy spirit to serve my king and master christ jesus heavenly father i give you all the glory honor praise and worship The Bible says you are Jehovah Nissi which means the Lord is my victorious banner. I thank you Father for the victory I have in the wonderful name of your beloved son Jesus Christ. Amen. Prayer 2. Father, we thank you for making us see a new year. There were many that desired to see this new year but they were unable to. It is not that we are better than them. or that we are more righteous than them it's just because of your mercy thank you lord for your many mercies because they encompass us like a shield and protect us from the fiery darts of the wicked we thank you for the many battles seen and unseen that you fought on our behalf last year thank you for not allowing the enemy to have the last laugh over our lives and that of our loved ones We bless you because you are holy and righteous and faithful and your eyes are ever upon us. Blessed be your holy name in the name of Jesus. Prayer 3. Dear Lord, I pray that in this new year you will cause me to be in the center of your will for my life. Please do not let me stray from your presence, but rather help me to keep my eyes focused on you. Let every step I take and every decision I make be in line with your will for my life. I pray I will be in the center of your will morally, spiritually, in my career or business and in everything I lay my hands on. Prayer for I pray for spiritual growth in this new year that my spiritual life will not be stagnant. and that I will be a good ambassador of Christ. Lord, please show me the steps I need to take to grow spiritually. Open my eyes to see those things that I need to let go and give me the grace to embrace what must be done for me to grow up unto you in all things. As I take steps to pursue faith and holiness with a good conscience, O oh Lord, Please back me up in Jesus name. Amen. Day 3. Prayer for a financial breakthrough. Scripture reference Proverbs chapter 3 verse 9 to 10. Honor the Lord with your possessions and with the first fruits of all your increase, so your barns will be filled with plenty and your vats will overflow with new wine. Scripture reference Psalms chapter 118 verse 25 Save now I pray O Lord O Lord I pray send now prosperity Scripture reference Psalms chapter 35 verse 27 Let them shout for joy and be glad who favor my righteous cause and let them say continually let the Lord be magnified who has pleasure in the prosperity of his servant Scripture reference Ecclesiastes chapter 5 verse 19 As for every man to whom God has given riches and wealth and given him the power to eat of it 
to receive his heritage and rejoice in his labor. This is the gift of God. Introduction Prayers are a powerful way of communicating with God. There are times that we need help to get out of a financial crisis. Or you may need to break the chains of debt, lack of money, and poverty. Praying for money or a financial breakthrough? Our God truly is a God of abundance. He wants to bless us in our comings and our goings. So don't be anxious or fretful. Ask the Lord for direction and guidance. Listen to the still small voice of the Holy Spirit and allow the Lord to work through your difficult decisions and tasks. Let us make God the focus of everything we do by including Him in the simplest of activities and events in our lives. And let's see the manifestation of God's power. Let us pray. I praise you, Almighty King. I bless your holy name. Thank you for providing all my needs according to your riches in glory. You never fail me, even in these difficult times, when finances are low and worry invades my mind. Help me to be at peace. Father, confident in your blessed assurance that you will supply all my needs out of your rich abundance. Lord, I've made financial mistakes. I've mismanaged my money. My debts are out of control. But Lord, I know you can open a way where there seems to be no way. I pray for a financial breakthrough in my life right now. Grow my finances and bestow on me wisdom to manage your blessings righteously. Open my eyes today to job opportunities and profitable business ventures. May I be a good steward of all that you provide. Help me not to depend on money, but only you, Jehovah Jireh, my provider. Don't allow money to destroy my relationships through tension and disagreements. I pray that the greed of money will not entrap my heart, but I will only hunger and thirst after you and your righteousness. May I shrewdly use what you have provided for me. Help me to remember that as I am blessed, I should bless others as well. Remind me to lend a helping hand to those who are less fortunate. In Jesus' mighty name, I declare my financial breakthrough is here. Amen.